Setting up a VPN with Starlink requires understanding both what VPNs provide and the unique challenges that Starlink's satellite internet presents. Let's explore these fundamentals. A VPN, or virtual private network, creates an encrypted tunnel between your device and a VPN server. This protects your internet traffic from being monitored by your internet service provider, hackers, or government surveillance. However, as of 2025, Starlink routers still lack built-in VPN server or client functionality. Unlike traditional routers that may include VPN features, Starlink's proprietary firmware is closed source with limited customization options. Starlink uses carrier-grade NAT or CGNAT, which means multiple users share the same public IP address. This creates additional complexity for VPN connections, as traditional port forwarding and direct connections become difficult or impossible. Starlink's satellite architecture introduces several technical challenges. The typical latency of 20 to 40 milliseconds, while impressive for satellite internet, still impacts VPN performance. Additionally, dynamic IP assignment means your connection details change frequently. Despite these limitations, several solutions are available. The most common approaches include using third-party routers in bypass mode, installing VPN software directly on individual devices, or implementing dedicated VPN appliances for enterprise use. For optimal performance over satellite connections, certain VPN protocols work better than others. WireGuard is highly recommended due to its efficiency and low overhead. OpenVPN with UDP also performs well, as does IKV2 IPsec, which handles connection changes gracefully. Avoid older protocols like PPTP and L2TP as they perform poorly over satellite links. Understanding these fundamentals is crucial before implementing any VPN solution with Starlink. The combination of satellite latency, CGNAT, and firmware limitations requires careful planning and the right approach for your specific needs. The third-party router method is the most popular approach for setting up VPN with Starlink. We'll walk through each step systematically to ensure a successful configuration. First, let's review the equipment you'll need. You'll require a compatible third-party router, an Ethernet adapter for the Starlink dish, and an active VPN service subscription. Step one is bypassing the Starlink router. Connect your third-party router directly to the Starlink dish using the Ethernet adapter. This eliminates the default Starlink router from the network path. Step two involves configuring the WAN settings. Access your router's admin interface and set the WAN connection type to dynamic IP or DHCP. Enable NAT traversal to handle Starlink's network architecture properly. Step three is installing the VPN client. Most modern routers have built-in VPN client functionality. Navigate to the VPN section of your router's interface and configure your VPN service credentials. Alternatively, you can use OpenW firmware for more advanced options. Step 4 focuses on optimization. The most critical setting is adjusting the MTU to Fortin 36 bytes, which is optimal for satellite connections. Enable hardware acceleration if available and configure quality of service settings to prioritize VPN traffic. The final step is testing your configuration. Verify that your IP address is masked by checking your external IP. Test for DNS leaks using online tools to ensure your DNS requests aren't bypassing the VPN. Monitor connection stability and choose VPN servers within 1,000 miles for optimal performance. This third-party router method provides comprehensive VPN coverage for all devices on your network. The configuration ensures optimal performance with Starlink satellite internet while maintaining security and privacy for all your connected devices.